Hello world, thanks for joining us again. We want to thank everyone who has subscribed and commented on our videos so far. We've had a lot of great input and learned some things along the way. We want to hear from you again, so we thought we would pose a question that some of you may have already considered. There are a number of missions planned to the Red Planet, and we have the highest hopes for each one of them. SpaceX hopes to unveil its Mars transport later this year, developing their own technology in-house. In an interview with Wired, Elon Musk said in order to reach the goal of multiplanetary life, the vehicles we utilize must be reusable. NASA is currently developing its Space Launch System, which is expected to be tested in 2018 and will be their first exploration class vehicle since the Saturn V. NASA plans to use a manned mission to an asteroid in 2025 to demonstrate key technologies for interplanetary travel before a Martian mission in the 2030s. You may have also heard of a project called Mars One. This is a proposal from a not-for-profit organization involving multiple launches. The first missions would land robots, supplies, and living quarters on the Red Planet before sending humans in 2024. One of the more exciting facets of this concept is that there are no planned return trips. Everyone who applies for this mission does so knowing they won't be returning to Earth. The question of whether or not you would spend the rest of your life on an alien planet is probably an easy one for some on either end of the spectrum. We want to hear from our subscribers, and maybe we're asking a biased audience. The point is, we want to ask an audience that spends their time thinking about the same things we do, so please give us your thoughts. Would you go on a one-way trip to Mars? Under what conditions? If you could only bring one thing with you, what would it be? Share in the comments below and stay tuned for our weekly wrap-up of all the latest space news this Saturday. Thanks for watching.